There's something about this place. It seems familiar, but I feel lost and alone again. Seems like I'm always looking for a new place, a new world, a place to call my own, a home that is for me and for me alone. Surging, floating, wandering. I need this to all wash over me, like the sun washes over these foreign, lifeless shapes lying still in immense gathering waters. An ocean I've never seen touched or felt before, but which feels right now as it draws nearer to me. Round, radiating, all consuming, but sparing as long as you don't stare too long. So I keep looking, back up to the sky. That's all we ever know, though we always want more. A test of all souls coming together from a distant place. Even if that moment only lasts a second, that second is more than a hundred lifetimes. And I've only got a few seconds here, sharing everything I have with the sun and the sun with me. Maybe that's all I need, maybe more. Peace is where the transit began, and peace is all I've ever wanted to know. But peace faded from where I came from, not from war, but from faded forms and shapes. It felt like home. The sun not so bright, but for a moment, I did not feel so alone, and a moment is all I've ever known. She came knowing a thousand memories of a radiant sun, the transit carrying her a very long distance, where space and time disappeared without warning, only to re-emerge at the water's edge. Sitting on the hillside, watching all the people die. I feel much better on the other side of the road. I believe in man. Magic. Why? Because it is so quick. I don't need power when I'm hypnotized. Look in my eyes. What are you seeing? I see 
how do you feel? I feel real phony when my name is Bill Or was that Bill? Life goes on here Day after day I don't know if I am living or if I'm supposed to be Sometimes my life is so eerie And if you think I'm happy I've been here once I've been here twice I don't know if the third's the fourth Or if the, the fifth's to fix Sometimes I deal with numbers And if you wanna count me Count me out I don't need the times of day Time with me is okay. I just don't want you using up my time. Cause that's not right. She arrived with barely a whisper of fleeting sound, but a flash of white, hot, blinding light traveling with speed only sheer velocity, and the jealous stars surrounded by hungry darkness seemed to know. A new form does her body take, high above the ocean's gaze, then lowered down into this new world's embrace. No passerby would believe or forsake this reflection, a beauty not yet touched by fate, crest only by careless gestures solitude has chosen to make. But fate always comes to those who wait, waiting forever. And she has waited a thousand lifetimes for this time to arrive. With sight and sound wrapped inside a gentle but nimble mind, she finds herself searching for summer one more time. A mind wrapped inside the waves and waves that roll towards her as if to say, you will be mine, please be mine. The sun knows her name and calls for her attention with the golden rays not beholden to gravity or locked in any realm, reminding her, summoning her, of where she once came, but too far away now to touch her with the same sensation, as it slips back way beyond the new planet's tide and toil. 
It has her looking up to the sky, searching, reconnecting, navigating with her own orbit, as the orb is offered to the sky as her guide back to the place where she had begun. Safe for now, safe for a moment. And the moment has finally come. A thousand memories of the radiant sun. She has finally reached out beyond the stars and had finally begun. Castaways, aren't we all? How many more years do we wait upon the fall and beg the summer not to desert us yet again? And that is where our story begins. A story about the last summer that must come to an end. And why this girl must accept the cold fall someday soon sooner than she knows. Of all the other souls, she alone will survive, when all she knows and loves are the long summer days soaked in the heat of a thousand suns with no end, and all they offer and will always thrive. Alive. 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 Have you been there before? Walk down your doorsteps, you'll take some more steps. What did you take them for? There's a private in my boat, and he wears his instead of medals on his coat. There's a chicken in my nest, and she won't play until I've given her my best. At her request, she asks for nothing. You get nothing in return. If you want, she brings you water. If you don't, then you will burn. You go through changes, it may seem strange. Is this what you're put here for? You think you're happy and you are happy, that's what you're happy for. There's a man who can't decide if he should fight for what his father thinks is right. There are people wearing frowns who'll screw you up, but they would rather screw you down. At my request I ask for nothing, you get nothing in return. If you're nice, you bring me water. If you're not, then I will burn. Secrets and well-told lies, a breath and a sigh, she will witness the transit, but after no more see with ever-curious eyes. The girl who knew too much, so has been chosen to discover what the rest of us drifting like lost planets share in our minds, and already know. The moment has come, and alone wrapped within the sun is all we ever are.